Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you three different solutions to fix the error that says, we can't activate Windows on this device as we can't connect to your organization's activation server. So let's dive right in. First, ensure you're connected to your organization's network, as this is crucial for the activation process. Once connected, look for the troubleshoot option below or next to the error code. Or you can go to the Start menu and write Troubleshooting Settings. Click on it to start detecting the problem. Follow any recommendations provided by the troubleshooter. It might even automatically fix the issue for you. If the troubleshooter doesn't resolve the problem, click on the Windows search bar, type CMD, and select Run as Administrator. Click Yes when prompted. In the command prompt window, you'll need to run a series of commands. Start with the following command, sfc slash scan now. This command will scan for any integrity violations that might be preventing Windows activation. Let it run until it's 100% complete. Next, run the dissim command to restore the health of your system. dissim space slash online space slash cleanup hyphen image space slash restore health. This will take some time to complete. While the dissim command is running, you can minimize the window and open another command prompt as an administrator. In the new command prompt window, we'll run additional commands to resolve the activation issue. Start with the command slmgr.vbs space slash dlv. This will display detailed license information. Look for your product ID and license ID. Next, run this command slmgr.vbs space dash ipk and then type your actual product key. Take your time to enter it correctly, then hit enter. Finally, type slmgr.vbs space slash ato and press enter. This command attempts to activate Windows. Once these commands are complete, restart your computer and check if the issue is resolved. If the previous methods didn't work, try configuring the key management service server. Open command prompt as an administrator and type the following command. slmgr space slash skms space kms8.msguides.com Press enter. You'll get a confirmation that the machine name has been set. Then type slmgr space slash ato and hit enter again to attempt activation. Restart your computer once more and this time the problem should be resolved. If this video helped you out, make sure to join the Show Me Software free newsletter. It's linked in the description below. In this newsletter, I will tell you about the latest software tools and AI that can make you more productive at work and also improve your personal life in many different ways. You can also reply to these emails with any technical support questions you might have, and I'll do my best to help you out for free. This newsletter is completely free and will always be free. So click the link in the description to sign up.